welcome to this video. I wanted to spend just a little bit of time just talking about goal setting. Normally at the beginning of each year, we all look back at the previous year to see the things that we've accomplished and the things that we didn't manage to accomplish throughout the year. And we tend to look at January as the month that we set goals for the new year to achieve new things and move forward in our careers and in our lives and I found it really useful this year because I was following a program which was all about setting goals and making you sit down and really think about what it is that you want to achieve and where it is that you're heading and it was such a powerful thing to do because I feel more focused than ever before this year. I know where I'm trying to go, I know the direction that I'm heading for, and I know the steps that I need to take to get there. And sometimes it can be overwhelming because we don't always realise that it's the small steps that take us forward. We look at the big picture and think, oh, well, I can never make it. And, you know, it looks so far away from where you're trying to get to. But it's the day by day small steps that will take you to the place where you want to be. And I spent um, some time looking at my goals and where I wanted to be and kind of working backwards from there. And it's not just goals in career, because you've also got to think about your financial goals. Where do you see yourself financially this year? How much money do you want to make this year? And how are you going to achieve that? So you've got to look at all different areas, whether it be finances, um, health is always a big one for people. Everybody wants to improve their fitness. And I think in the world that we live in at the moment, then it's really a necessity because we're eating food that really has no real vitamins in it and more and more people are getting ill each and every day so you've got your health and fitness goals what are you going to do to get fitter and feel more healthy um, and it's not just about signing up for a gym membership which is what we all do and, and never end up using it it's about doing the things that you enjoy. So if you hate going to the gym, then do something different. Some people like doing team sports, um, maybe join a club, a uh, football club or netball club or hockey or something where you've got a t you're working as a team. Um, I love music and I love dancing. So for me, you know, doing something that involves dancing is always great and so much fun. So think about what you enjoy and don't think that you've just got to go and join the gym because that's what everybody is saying to do If because you'll just be wasting your money at the end of the day. Um, so you've got your career goals, um, you've got your financial goals, you've got your health and fitness goals. What about family? What are the goals for the family? Do you need to spend more time with somebody? Are you working so hard that you're not spending enough time with your wife or your husband or the kids or um, parents or brother and sister, etc., friends? Um, I know that's something that I need to improve on, not spending enough time with my friends. Um, and sometimes it's just about scheduling time in the diary to make time for people because you know, you never know what's going to happen from the next day, uh, from one day to the next. And it's important to spend time with the people that you love because there's no guarantee of tomorrow. You know, you don't know what's around the corner. So I don't want to be morbid, but I'm just saying it's really important to spend time on the things that matter to you. Spend time with the people that you care about and do the things that you enjoy because I've struggled with that in my life where I've ended up doing things that oh, I've absolutely hated and you know when you hate it but you just do it because you have to but that really isn't the way forward and that gives you no satisfaction in your life. So I would recommend always follow your passion. Always follow what it is that you're passionate about. What gets you excited in the morning? What do you get a buzz off of doing? Always follow that 
leading and you know you'll be surprised at how your life evolves and, and and what a great life you can have so i just wanted to make this quick short video just to encourage people to just spend a little bit of time you know looking at your goals and writing them down you know it's always great when it's in black and white write it down if you need any help then contact me not a problem um i'll try and help you um but just think about where you're heading you don't want to get to December and you haven't achieved what you wanted to achieve so sit down and spend a bit of time thinking about it and then working your way back as to well what steps do you need to take to get there so I encourage you all in whatever it is that you're doing keep moving forward never give up and I shall speak to you again soon